guys, it's MZ Cheese, and my friend's doll finally came, and today I'm going to do a review on Mary Ellen and her poodle skirt outfit. Well, let's begin. So my friend got this doll when they were doing the buy a doll, give a doll thing, and so here is a little note that they sent her, and it says, together we make the holidays Here's to a friendship that's lovely and new. Be thankful for her, a new bestie for you. It's a wondrous and bright, your holiday fun, but with your new friendship, it's just begun. You've got a best friend and new stories to tell, and now a girl in need gets a friend as well. Which I think is a really sweet thing. I'm really glad that my friend was able to give a doll to someone else who really needs a doll more than her. Let's start off with Mary Ellen's poodle skirt outfit. It contains one scarf, one shirt, a pair of shoes, a pair of socks, and the poodle skirt. The first thing is the scarf, and it is a very nice thin and light material. It has sort of a peach background and reddish polka dots. It does have a tag down there. Some people choose to cut it off, some leave it on, but I know my friend's going to leave it on. Next is her shirt, and the sleeves are the nice lightweight fabric, just like the scarf. It has that peachy pink color and has the reddish polka dots. This is what the back looks like. It has Velcro and a tag on the inside. The collar is folded down and has one, two, three, four buttons on it. The shirt has a Peter Pan collar, and I think that this is a very well made shirt. Here are Mary Ellen's saddle shoes. They are very nice shoes. Um, to start off, the bottom is textured, this like brown diamond texture. And then on the top, it has two laces where you can tie the shoe. I wish it was Velcro. A white strip here and here, a black strip here. This is what the back looks like. And these shoes are hard to get on the dolls, so just beware of that. Next are the socks that come in the set. They are very thick, they are white, but because they're so thick, this may be the reason why it's hard to fit the saddle shoes onto the doll. So this is why people usually buy this set, it's for the skirt itself, and I have to agree, it's very nice. First of all, it is a black, thick fabric, which the skirt is made out of. The leash of the poodle is embroidered, and the poodle itself is an applique with two little bows on the ear and neck. It also has a nice stretchy elastic waistband at the top. I will show you. See, it stretches nice and wide, but be mindful not to overstretch it. I will now show you the entire set. Here is what the entire set looks like all together. Now let's take a look at the big Mary Ellen doll. Here is what Mary Ellen looks like inside her box, and let's open her up. The first thing that comes inside the box is Mary Ellen's storybook. Okay, Mary Ellen is out of her box, and let's take a closer look at her. The first thing is Mary Ellen's black tea shoes. They are very plain, so you, they can go with many different outfits. Here is a side view of the shoes, a back side view of the shoes, and the bottom of her shoes are very shiny. Now let's take a look at Mary Ellen's outfit. Mary Ellen has about four different colors on her dress, red, pink, blue and white. She has two bows, one closer to her head and one on her waist. This dress is kind of thin, but it's still really cute. Let's take a closer look at her crocheted jacket. Here is Mary Ellen's jacket and I'm very happy with this. Um, it is the same teal color on her dress and the M is embroidered onto it. And what's great about this jacket is that it can come off. So if you wanted to put a white tank top on and then put this jacket over, it works. So thumbs up to the manufacturers of American Girl. I really like this detail. Here's Mary Ellen's sweet little face. I'm pretty sure Mary Ellen has the original face mold. But anyways, she has swooped bangs, feathered eyebrows, and a deep part. Here's Mary Ellen's hair from the back. And it's slightly curled, but it's kind of funny. The manufacturers of American Girl tagged her with the straight hair doll pamphlet, which, yeah, I don't see how that works, but according to them, she is straight hair. 
Overall, I think Mary Ellen is a gorgeous doll, and if you wish to get her, I definitely recommend her. Please remember that Mary Ellen is not my doll, it is my friend's doll. I'm going to have Mary Ellen get into her poodle skirt outfit now. Just a moment, please. That was fast. Let's take a look at you. Okay, Mary Ellen looks so cute in this outfit. I think they really captured the 50s style. Here is everything that my friend bought for herself. And I'm very proud of my friend because she was able to get a doll for herself. This is her very first doll. And she was able to give a doll to someone who really actually needs a friend. So this is the end of my Mary Ellen review. Please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. I will see you on Monday with a new stop motion. Bye!